Hello, welcome to a new video. I really want to try record some of my inktober drawings. So in this video I am drawing a little fruit bat. One of the things that is really fun with this challenge is to try new subjects to draw. And I do not think I have drawn many bats before. I do think he turned out quite cute though. This is my first time joining Inktober, so I am really excited but kind of nervous too. My goal is to try making an illustration for each day, so hopefully I can do all the 31 days. If you want to see all of the illustrations for the challenge, you can find them on my Instagram account, which is linked in the description. When planning out Inktober, I was trying to figure out what kind of paper I wanted to use and I found some old watercolor paper that I have hadn't used for a long time and I thought I could use that for Inktober. It is not really good though, it can bleed really easily, which you can see in some parts of the illustration. And usually if you get some paint where you don't want it, you can lift it up with some water. But this paper does not want you to do that. It's also really hard to get an even wash of color. It gets really streaky. So if I use too much water, it bleeds. Or if I use too little, it gets really streaky. So that's really frustrating. But I think it makes it an extra challenge when you use um, difficult art supplies, and that's not a bad thing. But I will probably use some other papers too for, uh, the, for Inktober, since it's kind of annoying using uh, frustrating paper every day. The materials I am using is Stadler pencils for sketching, which is erasable, and I'm also using Faber-Castell's Pitt Artist Pen in Dark Sepia in Indian ink and also Windsor and Newton watercolors which I love a lot. I will list it all in the description. I really hope you liked the illustrations and thank you so much for watching. Bye!